parabolic income. Uh, in this video, I wanted to talk about the situation with FX Master Go and their newest announcement. I had tons and tons of DMs uh, regarding that, so I wanted to address that. Uh, in this video, I'm also going to talk about Anton, our client from last week, and how he's doing with his account. Um, but first of all, I just hope you guys are enjoying your weekend. Uh, at Parabolic Income, we're taking obviously the weekend off from trading obviously but we don't take a break in, in analyzing the market structure and pricing structure uh, so we're prepared for the next week to come um, if you guys for, for anyone that onboarded last week uh, I'm hope you guys I hope you guys are enjoying the last two days of profits because it's been insane um, so if you guys still want access to our EAs make sure you join our group in the description below and you can order uh, all the services available now all right let's talk about FX master go so I just read this about three hours ago um, and I did some charts on TradingView and by the way if you guys don't know what TradingView is it's basically just a, a separate platform where you can you have you get a ton of tools uh, to kind of analyze your charts in all right anyways I don't have an affiliate link I'm not affiliated I don't have a broker link or anything like that I don't, I don't do those affiliate stuff um, so if you're interested you can check it out you can google it or you can ask somebody for their like coupon code or affiliate link you get a discount on that all right so um, from the gist of the, I, I'm assuming everybody kind of read this already, but uh, I'm just gonna quickly go through this. Uh, so basically, they're just trying to open a, a some uh, like a like a social copier platform. So basically, they're allowing everybody, or, or it seems like they're allowing everybody to use their strategy. Um, uh, using different brokers now so that people can use their own brokers. Uh, like I mentioned in my last video, I always said choose freedom. Use it on any any broker. Uh, use use the ea or any broker that's the ultimate freedom and i think they kind of took a uh took a hint from 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 that i mean it makes sense uh, i think you should allow everybody to use their brokers i don't think that there should be any issues um but for me personally um if you ask me for my insight and and this is just playing devil's advocate i think um ultimately i mean i'm gonna have to see what what they're gonna do in the next coming weeks um or so but i'm assuming they're gonna charge you I mean, for, for copy trading first, I, I think that's that'd be that'd be smart of them to do if they wanted to make money. I, I mean, they'll charge you another premium on top of it. So, like for example, if you want to copy trade us, you're gonna charge you X amount as a one-time fee or something like that, and then plus profit sharing, uh, because profit sharing for them it's gonna be very difficult to do on these two platforms. Um, the reason being is that if you're not using the same broker, it's very difficult to transfer money. Um, uh, transfer money internally right so if they're using if you're using a different broker um from them is they would have to charge you in a different way right they, they'd have to charge you through through crypto or credit card right but if you're doing credit card that's actually a very a very sensitive topic a very difficult um topic the reason being is that you know charging for for profits um it, it can lead to tons of uh chargebacks or fraudulent activity so it's very difficult to find a merchant or a processor willing to uh, take those charges uh, that's a little bit um, very long topic uh, but if you guys are interested in that topic you can dm us and we can talk we can discuss about it uh, but in terms of what fx master is about to do i'm not quite sure yet i don't want to jump into any conclusions um, but i would be very very careful i would tread carefully uh, regarding what they're going to do and i wanted to also say like um i was reading their website like you know a few days ago and i realized like that they don't use eas to trade and they're kind of like um not really like we don't use robots um people say that you know EAs are better than real trader and it's not I mean it really depends right and, and it really shows you why sometimes people use EAs versus versus people trading as you can see here there they said that you want to be transparent but however some some person was under stress and a trader did not and use unsafe lot size and and that really goes to show show you why EAs are very important because you know human human emotions or human psychology always, will always get in the way they're always fine to get, get in the way and and that led to an account being blown and it's not just one guy it's it's impacted so many people right just maybe he had a bad day maybe he fell or maybe his girlfriend or boyfriend <laughs> broke up with him right I'm not sure it could be anything right it could be you know maybe financial troubles it could be maybe maybe someone just flipped him off when he was driving to work who knows right he got emotional and he he, he was willing to sacrifice that entire company's image plus everybody's money right and at the end all your money's gone now right so you, you can you can kind of consider like because sometimes does it make sense to have a robot to trade because it takes out all the emotions away and people are saying well how if the robot fails well that's why we have equity protectors right well that's why we have stop loss something that obviously humans fail to do right 
Okay, they forgot to put a stop loss, but a robot doesn't, right? They don't have emotion. Whatever you set, that's what they do, right? You you, you tell them to take a uh, take a trade on this uh, certain uh, a certain indication or a certain indicator, they'll take a trade. If you tell them to stop loss on a certain equity or a certain profit or certain loss, they'll stop loss. Well, they'll, they'll cut the trade. They don't have any emotion. They'll just execute whatever instruction that you give them, right? So that's the point of having EAs to trade, right? And can, can, I, do, can I say, like, are they 100% automated? No. You still have to be there to kind of watch what they do and adjust their performance, right? But at least your emotion, but at least you're not making the decisions when it's trading, when, when it's actually trading. When it trades, it just trades itself. You're not watching it. Right, because if you're a real trader and you're watching it, it, it as a, it, it's not, and, and trust me, every trade that you do will go drawdown, and and that's basically being negative, right? Hundred percent, every trade goes drawdown, and some people can't take it, right? <laughs> when they're seeing their accounts losing, you know, one percent, point five percent, or two percent, they get scared, they get emotional. Oh crap, man, I'm not sure if I should stop loss or I should just wait it out, right? That's 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 the flaw of humans, right? But anyways, you know, that's a huge topic, and and you know, I don't want to bash bash them too much. Um, but just just be careful, right? And, and consider some some insights, right? Because it's not trading as a human is not always the best thing, right? Um, sometimes EA could be be the the solution, right? Okay. Anyways, um, so that's that's what the FX Master Gold. If you guys uh, you know uh, have any, any any other questions, you can uh, join our Telegram group and, and um, we can discuss that further. Uh, I don't want to take too much away from this video. I just want to give you guys a quick update on Anton's account. Um, so Anton actually grow, grown his account by two hundred percent since we last actually did the video. And the reason why I'm doing this video is, is because after I, I published this, a lot of people are like, hey man, this account's getting blown. Ha ha ha, this account's gonna get blown in the next few days. And you know what? It's true. Like, it, it, it is possible it can be blown if they don't have a stop loss, right? Um, but Anton does have a stop loss. Um, I believe it's set at $1,000 or $2,000. So it really depends on him. Um, I'm not exactly 100% sure what he's he set it on. Um, but I think the last video we did was up to February 22nd. So in the la last two days, he did almost about another 5000 So he almost two or three X's count, depending on how you look at it. But essentially, he was able to grow his account from five thousand to now fifteen thousand dollars, right? And I actually messaged Anton early in the morning. I'm like, "Hey, man, you should withdraw some money." But he's so adamant on trying to flip this account to fifty thousand dollars. He's gonna, he's willing to risk it. Um, but I'm, I'm gonna try to convince him to take some money out, um, just because he can recover from you know his FX Master Gold losses. I mean. One thing about humans is we're greedy, man. Because <laughs> when you make smart, when you start making money, you get greedy and you want more money. And and I, I've been a victim of that, man. Like, guys, when you make profits, take it. Okay, don't give it back to market. But hey, if Anton wants to do that, he can do that. But please, man, I, if you're watching the video, I, I told you, all right. You should, I told you you should take some money out, all right. Take at least five grand out and then and then let it and then keep keep going, right. Anyways, I'm I'm very excited to see what he does with this account. I hope I hope he gets his 50k. I mean, I've done it before. It's not it's not hard at all as long as you properly manage it, as long as you properly set the risk settings. You're gonna good. You'll be good to go. And a lot of people have been asking me like, what what lot sizes uh, should we put for you know, for for our accounts and stuff like that. And even if we have a, a team member to help you guys out and calculate your lot sizes. I still feel I should touch on it because a, a lot of people think that um, when we say a small lot size or like like for example, um, if, if we tell them to use a, mo a lot multiplier by zero point two or zero point zero two, they'll ask me why is it so low. You know, because the reason being is that we want you to be safe and we want you to be able to see how the EA works and how it, it works on your account. The reason being is every broker has different lot sizes and uh, mostly are the same, but but the most important thing is every account balance is also different, right? Some people that might not agree to risking 1% of their account. Some people might not agree or feel comfortable risking 0.5%. Or even two percent, right? It really depends on the person. So I really recommend you guys to open a demo account from your favorite broker. Every demo account, I mean, every broker offers a demo account of various account sizes. So what I would do is I will, I would open a demo account in the account balance that you want it. So if you're if you know you're about to put a thousand dollars in, I would open a demo account with a thousand dollars. Now, mind you, they might not offer that. They might offer might offer something like two thousand or three thousand. They might not offer the exact account balance that you want, right? But the point of it, it is like once you create a demo account, you can put it on the 
you know, shows the traders tool, tools platform and you'll be able to plug the EA in the demo account and you'll be able to see how it basically uh, executes trades and how um, each, uh, each, how the profits and losses move based on, you know, uh, based on the instrument that you're trading, right? For example, like 10 lots in gold might not sound like a lot, but a dollar movement could be equivalent to a thousand dollars in profit or a thousand dollars in losses, right? So if you have a, if you have a thousand dollar account balance, and you put 10 lots, right? You lose your money if it, if it just goes up by a dollar. <laughs> and trust me, man, gold can go up to $17. It can move up, move down, right? And, 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 very, and it's very volatile, right? So you kind of have to have an understanding of how the lot sizes kind of work. And we have a team dedicated to helping you with your risk and, and lot sizes. But some people just, I, I'm assuming people don't really listen. They want to make money as quick as possible. And I completely understand that, right? But it's very important for you guys. Uh, I, recommend, I totally recommend opening a demo account. Um, and we've been recommending this every every since time every time everyone anytime anyone buys a service we always recommend using a demo account kind of play around with it first before you plug the EA into your real money right and I mean if you want to jump right I can or jump right in with your live account that's okay too like it, it doesn't really matter that's your decision to make we allow you to um, to use your the EA in any form that you like right um, I also wanted to let you guys know that we actually uh, our EAs actually passed 11 exams um, this week, uh, last week. Um, we tried to post some results into our channel, but you know some people don't feel comfortable with their names and stuff like that. But we did get some cool clients to let us uh, kind of publish their certificates and stuff like that. And we also got some payout certificates um, that we kind of published. Just to show you what our EAs and what our team can do for you. Um, We'll try in the next coming weeks or so to get more of these certificates so you can kind of see live testimonials of, of, of how our EA are doing and how our services are doing. Um, but mind you, uh, we do have to cross some of the names out because people prefer their privacy and it's really due to like, you know, the taxman reasons and, and, and just security, right? With all the stuff that's going on in the world, right? So, um, so I hope you guys, um, um, I hope you guys like the results so far. Uh, and if you guys have any questions, uh, please do not hesitate to contact us on uh, Telegram. Uh, I also wanted to touch on, uh, let me see here, uh, our new uh, our new bot that was released last week. Uh, we actually changed the name to Cypher uh, because the reason being force, uh, the Force EA was a little bit, uh, could, could maybe be copyright issues. So I, I just changed the name. So I hope you guys are not confused, uh, confused with that. Um, so if you, if you guys have any questions, like I said, Please do not hesitate to contact us um, on Telegram. The description is in the link below. Uh, in the description below, uh, if you like our channel, please follow, please subscribe, please like this video, and we'll see you in the next one. All right, peace.